But it's time now to reveal tonight's greatest Britain and Union jackass. My superstar panel return, Dominique Samuels. Who is your nominee for tonight's greatest Britain? Mine is former UK Minister Gareth Johnson for saying that Just Stop Oil should be designated a terrorist organisation. Yes! And I completely agree with him. I've been saying it for the past year. Finally, an MP's had the balls to say the same thing. Let's have a listen. For the Prime Minister, therefore, consider making Just Stop Oil a prescribed organisation yeah. so that they can be treated as the criminal organisation they actually are. Yes, Gareth. Sean Bailey, your nominee. My nominee is Lads Needs Dads, a community organisation that's set up to give training and support to young boys who are missing their father. They're great charities in this country, and this is one of the best. They're a really good bunch. Amy Nicole, your nominee. Uh, mine's FIFA. No, no, they're baddies. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's like going wrong way around. Alex Scott uh, for wearing the One Love armband. Oh, Having wearing an armband. <laughs> Amy, are you serious? This is a woman who had no problem going to Dubai and posing in her bikini when uh, homosexuality is illegal in that country too. And also had no problem posing for photos with uh, Vladimir Putin. So is she really someone who should take the moral high ground? Uh, I think wearing the armband in the circumstances in Qatar was hugely courageous. Well and done to you, Alex, deserves... for wearing an armband. Really? I'm going to go uh, with Gareth Johnson, though. I have been saying on this show for the past 12 months, just stop oil or a terrorist, eco-terrorist organisation. You can prove it in the law. Finally, someone had the balls to say it at West. You must have been in some absolutely awful traffic jams to come to that conclusion. Yeah, a lot of people have. Oh, Amy. Mm -hmm. Amy, I can, I can run it all. I'll show you after the show. Find Dominic Samuels, your union jackass oh. nominee, please. Uh, mine is uh, fashion brand Balenciaga. Oh, you um, can say it. Sorry, I, I've never actually heard it said out loud. I don't know how. Where have you been? But upon their launch of their, their upon the launch of their 2023 campaign, they saw fit to model what look like BDSM teddy bears for adults using children, amongst other things, very disturbing things that referenced okay. um, child pornography. Um, Jordan Bailey, they've been forced to apologise. My union jackass is Sadiq Khan for his get over it. Disingenuous idea that if he saved people from his bus bus cut. Your old rival. This is a old. This is a new low. Oh. He proposed the bus cuts. He U turned on them, and we're meant to thank him for that. This is a new disingenuous low. And Amy Nicole, like you sort of gave right, the now game it's away. But... Uh, it's FIFA. Yeah, you gave the FIFA game for away. FIFA showing their regard for the LGBT rights, human rights, by banning the One Love armband. Hours. Well, Amy, I don't think Sean should get over it. So yeah. I'm going to go with Sean and Sadiq. <laughs> Khan as today's union jackass because Sean has a very good point and my goodness our capital city would be in a much better place if Sean Bailey was currently <laughs> mayor of London.